Hello boys and girls, and welcome to another Verissimilitude arcade playthrough. Today, we're going something a little different. It's My Heroes One Justice. Okay, this is a Japanese anime. Uh, if you, any of you guys haven't heard about it, it's a really, really good cartoon from Japan. Um, it's basically about superheroes at an academy, like a high school academy that trains them. And they all face off against each other trying to help each one of them become better and it's, it's, it's just a really really good anime um, and if you haven't watched it I would absolutely suggest you go and check it out I believe it's on Netflix um, I believe it's on a few other sites it might be on Hulu on Amazon I, I'm not sure just look it up trust me you won't regret it um, the characters are fantastic my favorites are Deku and um, who's the guy you see on the left of the screen and uh, All Might, who is the guy we're going to be doing the arcade playthrough with today. Now, you might know All Might from Jump Force. And here's the man himself with stage one. Now, I've got Deku and Ochigo as backups. So the thing is, when you play an arcade playthrough in this game, you have your main character and the two backups that you can see there. Okay, let's go, All Might. Here we go against Tenga. Man, I, I love the stage destruction on this game. It's just so well done. <laughs> Where do you see this special move? It just, it looks fantastic. You can get some really good high hit combos here. Now this game's like relatively unknown, really. Um, not a lot of people know about um, My Heroes 1 Justice, the, the game. There's not really a lot of coverage about it. For me, I actually think it's a, a fantastic game. There you go, there's round one. I personally think it's one of the better fighters around. Um, that's just my opinion. A lot of other people would, would disagree, but I really like it. It's got that old school kind of PS1, PS2 feel about it with kind of hyped up PS4 graphics. Oh, damn. The trick is, is if you go in with your square and X attacks, and then go in with a special um, and usually what you want to do is get an assist when your assist character's energies are full bar like Deku's just got full bar now so hopefully you get him to come in and help you for two seconds and there you go look at it Deku no no he didn't do it okay there you go boom uh, we only got to hit him one more time come on Come on. I got you, Tanya. I got you. Out in the streets of Tokyo, superheroes face off against each other. Yeah, if anybody else has got this game out there, please hit me up. I'd love to play you online. Um, I am rubbish. Rank S. There you go. Rank S for the first stage. Yeah. You can't get bitten there. Some of your moves are still stiff. Oh my. He's all this. He's all this. But you know, hey, he's winning it for us. That's all that matters. Huh? I mean, that's all that matters. Okay, round two. Here we go. Round two. Fumikaj Tokayami. Okay, now this stage is really difficult because you're in a stadium. And as with some of the stages in this game, you get ring outs, kind of like in Virtua Fighter, where you knock them out of the stage. And I believe, well, I ain't gonna say anything, just keep watching. So when you nearly knock them out, they will come flying back and you keep pressing the X to get yourself back into the stage. Now, as you can see, he knocked me out there before I had a chance to even get myself back into the ring he smacked me down onto the ground now he looks like harmless <laughs> but the thing with him is that he always seems to get you at the most inopportune moments he's a difficult character to fight he doesn't look it but that summoning crow spirit thing he's got it's it's savage. If you can 
use him properly online, you can do so much damage. But All Might, I think he is the ultimate character in this game, and he's the one that I love playing on this game, so... Uh, oh, oh, I'm about to get knocked out. Get yourself back in, All oh, Might. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, baby, come on. Come on, baby. That's it. That's it. Okay, knock him out. Knock him out. Oh, jeez. Get back in. See what I mean? You need to get knocked out. You've got to pull yourself back in. All right. My only hope here is to just keep smacking him down. There you go. One round off. Final round, ready? Clash! Yeah, you know, I got it. I love the specials in this. I don't th oh, yeah, I got him. I got him. Boom, look at that. You know, this, I think, was the, kind of the foundation blocks for what they were going to do in Jump Force. And, um, I feel like this was maybe a testing ground for what they were trying to achieve in Jump Force. And, I love Jump Force. Jump Force has its detractors, but I'm personally a massive fan of it, so... Well, you know I am, because I'm always uploading matches. I think it's such a fun game to play, I think the graphics are fantastic. Um, I think the stage transitions are brilliant. I love this game. I think this is... Uh, again, it's just an arcade brawler. You know, it's very much in the vein of... The old arcade beat-em-ups, like Power Stone and... In a way, Super Smash Brothers. Ah, All Might once again. You show your supremacy. Win! What rank did we get? Ooh, B A S. I reckon that's an A. Yeah, that's an A. Mm, damn. All right. Well, we gotta keep going. Tokiyami, you sure are strong. You see, this is the thing. They always encourage each other, and they all look up to All Might. I am undeserving of such praise. <laughs> Round three. Here we go. We got an S, we got an A. It's A. Okay, here we go. Ochko. Now, this is one of our support characters that we have. Now, this is one of my favorite sages. This is the gymnasium at the school. And. I don't know what it is. I just really love the stage. Look how cool she looks in this game, Ochigo. I just her design is beautiful in this game. I think she looks like a proper anime cartoon in this. I think I think of all the characters in this game, she is the most. I don't know. She's the most fluid looking. I think, if that makes any sense. Ooh, she blocked well as well. Again, she's somebody who is underappreciated in this game I think well she doesn't look strong but this what she does here look at this I mean oh I blocked it there but that can cause a lot of damage you have to get in there before she summons that attack oh Deku we need some we need some help but we need some double archer go boom oh yeah <laughs> Now another thing you can do in this game is you can get the characters stuck in the wall and um, if you hit them against the wall and then whilst they're stuck in the wall with their, their legs twiggling out like that, you can just keep hitting them and use that time to get more damage. Or they can get you in the wall. Boom. Boom. Oh, damn. She got me. She got me. Alright, alright. We got her. We got her. It's round one. Round one. We got it. Which crazy shit like this happened in my gym? Damn, that'd be good. My gym, nothing happens. It's just a bunch of egos say nothing to each other. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Come on. I love the way you can you can knock the mat down. Go on, go on. Oh yes. I love it when you get big at combos, which I'm not really getting at the moment here. Oh, block. That's it. You've got to block a lot in this game. Throat! Swing! <laughs> it's proper cartoon. It's like got the 60s Batman TV show. Swamp. Ooh. Oh yeah, she used a double attack there. Okay, come on. We got you. We got you. We got you. Come on. Gotta keep her on the sides. 
Guard break, guard break. That's it, that's it, keep going, keep going. See now, if I'd knocked her a bit more there, she would have gone into the wall. Oh, damn, that's a hell of a block. All right, am I gonna get this in? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now, you, you recognize that special move with the wind? Obviously, that's one of All Might's signature moves, but for any of you guys who don't know much about him, that's the move he uses in Jump Force. Oh, I love this move. It's so good, off you go. Come on, come on, that's it. Oh, yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Come on, come on. Come on, do it. Come on, we need some Annie in this game. Come on, oh, yeah. All right, just a couple of more hits. Oh, no. We don't want that. We don't want that. Come on. Oh, no, she's got us down. It's going to be close. Two rounds down, straight. That's what I'm talking about. That's it. Hot behind the bench. Yeah. He's such a cool ass looking character. He's like the Japanese Superman, basically, isn't he? That's how I see it. He is basically the anime version of Superman. People are always going about, um, oh, we got a, we got an A. A B, an A, and an A. You're a ka 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 you still have some issues. I lost that when I'm going into the train and get stronger. That's right, girl. All right, round four. Here we go. Round four. Shota Aizawa. Okay, now this character is very, very difficult to beat. This is a brilliant, brilliant stage. You can cause so much destruction in this stage. This is like one of the classrooms, but there's like this like orange sky outside and it's just lush. I, I love this one. You can go out into the hall and it's awesome. We've got to that point now in games where they look so, well, they are cartoons basically, you know, but you can control them now. That's what I love about video games. Now, there you go. Look, I'm stuck in the wall. There you go, but I got out of it. Now, he could have caused a lot of damage there, but I'm trying to get him into the wall, but it's difficult to do. I've done it quite a few times though online, coincidentally though. Something talking about, come on, alright, let's do this. Come on, come on. Boom. Stop popping around, that's it. Okay, get him against the window, come on. Through the wall, you see that, look. Oh, up against the window, Ooh, smash. You know, all the destruction you can cause. Well, I'm really going for it in this one. Round two, baby. You ain't getting away from this. Stop running. <laughs> He's running. You don't know where to go. He cannot get away from the might of all might. Ooh, nice kick. That was a bit of a Black Panther from Civil War kick. 17 hits. That's what I'm talking about. Double moon. Oh my god, look at this. Man, I'm I'm savaging him here. Look at that. He ain't got a chance. He ain't got a chance. Come on. Down on the ground, baby. Down on the ground. Where you going? Where you going, huh? I reckon an A, yeah, an A. Oh, so close to an S, never mind. We've got an S for attack, which is good. Whew, that was fun, that's a while. It's been a while since we sparred. I wouldn't mind you holding back when you're facing me too, though I'm the one who should be thanking you, All Might. Such friendly banter. Banta. Okay, ah, oh, this character's great, Gran Torino. Should be Clint Eastwood from the film Gran Torino. Hey, this guy's great, this is a great character. This old dude who can kick ass, he's kind of like a, a superhero Yoda. See what I mean? He's awesome. 
It's such a cool character. The stage destruction in in this stage is brilliant. You can this this one this is a good stage to train for uh, getting them stuck in the wall. See, look, you can see all the people outside and all the cars outside. It kind of reminds me a little bit of. I mean, it's it's mostly like Power Stone. If you guys ever played the game Power Stone from years ago, and it does remind me a lot of like a, a closer more well a 3d version of super smash brothers um but it also kind of reminds me of dead or alive in a weird way i don't know why it's nothing like dead or alive obviously but the the kind of the surroundings and stuff it has that feel about it it's a lot more floaty obviously by its very nature than dead or alive there you go stuck i was stuck in the wall again this guy, I've been stuck in him so many times. But, ooh, geez. Ooh, see, you got to be careful with those double attacks. Use the walls very proactively because they can really come in handy, especially if you do a dash move, which is when you keep your finger on L1. Um, and if you dash in towards the character and then bounce off the wall, you'll do a lot of damage. Kind of like what I did there, but... What I'm basically... I'm, I'm concentrating on trying to get him stuck in the wall. I'm sorry, old man. Oh, God. He's going to town. No way. Woo! Oh my god. Alright, alright. That's it, that's it. Okay. So, okay, we need you there. A couple of more hits. I'm sorry, Gran Torino. But you gone. Phew, no, I'm not. He's pulling back. Nah. I'm sorry, old man. Damn, he's hopping around. He ain't giving up. I mean, youth, win. Look, um, the, the detail on the sprites are beautiful. Sprites, they're not sprites anymore. I still call them sprites back from the old days when they were actually pixelated sprites. Ooh, rank A, we got an S and a B and an A. Keep getting high marks for attack. It's technique. I always fail on story in my life. I ain't saying none. You're so slow. You're too damn fast, though I did have a fun time sparring with the young ones. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Yeah. Always be careful when you're playing against Gran Torino because the one thing that he will always do that will always mix you up when you're playing against him is he'll come up with these really quick attacks. Here we are now for the last stage against our boy Deku. Deku! Now you recognize Deku, right? That's our boy. Along with All Might, he's in Jump Force. Okay, this is, this is the outside of the school. This is the famous school from the anime that you see outside. And here, we're playing right outside the front door. The graphics in this stage are lovely. You knock down the pillars. And... In a lot of ways, this looks even better than the cartoon. And the cartoon looks amazing. I love Deku. I love him in um, Jump Force. I haven't used him in a while in Jump Force, actually. Boom. Oh. Yeah. See those pillars? Use them to your advantage. Don't just knock them down willy-nilly. First of all, try to get your opponent into the wall. Get them stuck in the wall. But then when you're over there, knock them into the pillar and then go for a dash move. Hopefully, I can show you what I mean. Although, I might not. Oh, yeah, I think I got him. I think I got him. Son of a bitch hops. Alright. One round down. This is it. This is it. This is the decider. Come on. This is it to decide the final of the whole game. Round two. Get your way us back here. 
This is America, Jack. Actually, it's not. It's Japan. All right, let's do it. Oh no. That's it. See, see what I mean? He comes in with a uh, a wall jump. See, Deku's quite tricky sometimes. In the right hands, he's possibly the, the the most deadly character in the game. All Might is the strongest, but Deku has got the all-round. He's got technique, strength, speed. He's got everything. And there we are, look. He's dead. That's it. I mean, that's it. You know what I'm saying? We did it. It's the arcade playthrough of all mate. I hope you guys are are enjoying these arcade playthroughs and I hope you've enjoyed this one in particular um, because I want to do something different every so often, you know? You got an A. Okay, now we're going to get a tally up of our final score. Did you think I was going to go easy on you? Sorry. But if you're going to be my successor, I'm going to need to give you everything I've got. Even at a time limit, his power is the real deal. All Might really is amazing. He's the greatest hero in the world. Ah, Jesus. Ah, shucks. Well, that's it, boys and girls. That's another RK playthrough from Brisson Militude. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, peace.